Mr. Chu, do you agree that the Chinese government has persecuted the Uyghur population? Congresswoman, you, if you use our app and you open it, you will find our users who that's get not, all sorts of content. That's not my question. My question is, do you agree that the Chinese government has persecuted the Uyghur population? Well, it's really concerning to hear about all accounts of human rights abuse. My role here is to explain what our platform does evasive. on this. I think you're It's a pretty easy question. Do you agree that the Chinese government has persecuted the Uyghur population? Congresswoman, I'm here to describe TikTok and what we do as a platform. And as All a right. platform, we allow our users to freely express All their views right. on this issue Earlier and any today, other issue that matters to them. Well, you didn't answer the question. Earlier today, Chairman Rogers asked you, and I quote, have any moderation tools been used to remove content associated with the Uyghur genocide, yes or no? Your answer, we do not remove that kind of content. Yet... In 2019, TikTok suspended the account of Feroza Aziz, an American 17-year-old, after she put out a video about the Uyghur genocide. So your answer, sir, does not align with history. That particular I, case was a mismoderation. I believe I, that video had a picture of Osama bin Laden. So no, we thought it was content no, that was inappropriate. I, yeah, I looked it up. That was a different post that they banned. TikTok I can get back banned. on the specifics, yes. 